After struggling for 6 months with my sugar cravings as a mom and smashing off 29 kgs, these are the secrets you need in order to be able to achieve your weight loss results as a mom while putting your cravings permanently under control. Number 1. You want to make sure that those things you're always craving for, especially if they are junks, they are not healthy foods like me. I was always craving for sugars and junks and pastries, juice. All these were always available in the house because of my children. And the moment I decided in order to be able to achieve my weight loss result, I needed to get those things out of sight because out of sight is actually out of mind. When you have those things you're always craving for, constantly in your face, they are in the house with you or they are in the office with you. You'll be craving them because every time you are seeing them, it's going to your mind that I need to take this, I need to put this in my mouth, I need to put this in my body. So keeping all those jokes, all those sugary, all those tasty processed things out of my house as a mom. So for that six months, because I knew there was no way they are going to be in the house and I'll not be testing them and I'll not be picking on them and I'll not be eating some of them because I actually tried. What I ended up doing was taking half and leaving half of it. I'll eat some one, two, three biscuits, leave half of it. I'll drink some of the juice, leave half of it. But the moment I took them out of my house completely, yes, buy the snacks for the children in the school. That was what me and my husband agreed. Instead of having it in the house and it was a serious source of temptation and setback for me on my weight loss journey. So once I took them all out of the house, I was 80% free. Another thing that helped me achieve control over my cravings for sugar as a mom was the fact that I started sleeping better. If you're not getting enough sleep as a mom at night, at least seven hours of sleep, your hormones will be all over the place. The hormones that are responsible for appetite, fullness, cravings will be out of balance in your body during the day, giving you all kinds of funny signals, making you do things that you are not supposed to do, making you crave for things that you are not supposed to crave. In those days, I don't used to sleep up to seven hours. I was not sleeping well. The moment I started going to bed early enough, I maintained the same bedtime routine every night. So once it's 10 p.m., I'm already in bed. I started getting a minimum of seven hours of sleep. I realized that my cravings in the daytime subsided drastically. Another thing that helped me overcome my cravings for sugar was I replaced all those unhealthy junk processed things I was always craving for with healthy alternatives. Instead of me eating biscuits, eating cakes, drinking juice, I started going for healthier versions of my cravings for sugar. So it's not a sin that your body craves for sugar, but what is the sin is the kind of sugar you decide to give to your body as a mom. So your body actually needs that sugar, but it's better you're giving the body the right kind of sugar, which are the sugars that come from whole natural foods. And our fruits are loaded with natural sugar that's satisfies your body's cravings for sugar so when i took out all those junk refined processed things out of my house i loaded my house with healthy alternative of snacks which are lesser in calories and keeps you fuller for longer so that's another way i was able to curb my cravings for sugar as a mom another way to curb your cravings for sugar as a mom when you are actually sedentary or bored i usually get those cravings when i've been doing something maybe i've been on the laptop for hours or i've been reading for hours or out of boredom you want to wind your mouth when you are bored instead of going to nibble on things put things in your mouth change your environment or change your posture if you are lying down sit up if you were sitting down stand up if you were standing walk take walks just change your posture engage in an activity something more relaxing more comforting more suiting or more enjoyable more fun for you by the time i change the current activity i am doing that is making me have cravings that is making me crave for something sweet the craving goes away. Another way to control your cravings as a mom so that you can stick to your weight loss plan and smash off your weight completely is by drinking lots of water. Stay hydrated. When you are dehydrated, your body starts craving for all kinds of things. I noticed that those days when I was always licking sweet, eating biscuit, drinking juice, ice cream, I don't drink water. But the moment I started drinking enough water, I aimed for drinking a cup of water every hour. I was staying full longer and I was not craving for things again. Drink enough water. If you're drinking water and your body is hydrated, it controls those cravings for sugars and processed things naturally. And finally, this is the most important step of them all I think really helped me. Was my mindset, working on my mindset with my cravings for sugar. I changed my mindset seeing those things not as comfortable not give myself energy i started seeing those processed junk refined chemicals 
heavily calorie, no nutritional value, junk as poison to my body. And this was the game changer. There's no way I'm going to put that in my mouth. There's no way that thing is going into my body because I started seeing all those processed junk, sugary, refined things as poison. I don't want my body to be damaged. I want to live a healthy life in a healthy body as a mom for the rest of my life. That one was the motivating factor that kept me away from all the sugary coke factor, my addiction to sugar. These were the steps I used on my weight loss journey as a mom. And I was able to smash off my weight, controlling my cravings for sugar naturally and drastically. And up till now, that I've smashed off all that weight, I don't crave for sugary things anymore. Maintaining the steps that I have just shared with you has helped me control my appetite naturally without stress. So that even now that I have those things in the house, I see them and I don't feel like eating them. And when I try to put those things in my mouth, the sugariness of those things sends shivers down my spine. I'm not even comfortable putting those sugary things into my mouth. So naturally, my taste bud for sugary things has been taken care of permanently. So even if I have an occasion where I have to eat cake or drink juice, maybe when somebody is doing an event, there's a birthday celebration going on, I just pick one or two. It's not as if I stay like this and I'll be craving for cake. I want to eat cake or I want to drink cake. It doesn't happen. I drink water and I am fine. So instead of me drinking coke and drinking all those, I drink naturally made drinks like Tiger Nut. Healthier alternatives. If you want to smash your cravings for sugar as a mom, so you can smash off your weight completely and permanently, start following these tips and you will see yourself overcoming that struggle of cravings for sugar daily. And the more you are smashing your sugar cravings, the more faster you are smashing your weight and achieving your weight loss goals.